Hey, so, um, well, actually, we got a lot of stuff done. This is Alpha, bring you some survival. Uh, we've built this giant wooden thing. Um, we've actually done some things with the stone flower. And we've added a new mod called the Lots of, Lots of Food mod. So, now we have all these f different types of fish. Five different types of fish. The trout, the salmon, the sole, whatever, the hake, I really don't know what it's called, and the golden fish. Now, if you didn't see my inventory, we have this thing called the purified meat. The purified meat, pretty much, it's just rotten flesh, but you put it into a furnace, and then it'll give you purified meat. So instead of making you hungry, it'll heal two food bars, or chicken wings, whatever. These are pepper plants. When broken, they will give you peppers, like so. And then you can put one in, and you get four pepper seeds. Bam, bam, bam. Bam, four. Now let's go upstairs. Um, we gotta put these peppers into our food chest. Now, not there. Not only is there are there peppers now there is chocolate cake there's this is cheesecake um yeah don't mind this for now but we have toffee apples and um you gotta turn off that uh so you got chocolate caramel cheese sandwich chocolate bread caramel pancake steak tartare bread cheese yeah all that stuff and this we have some mushroom stew that's normal and now we got pumpkin soup, pasta, cactus soup, chili con carne, and then some chocolate ice cream, apple ice cream, yeah, all that good stuff, melon, melon juice. Let's eat more of this cake. Um, I'm probably going to make another chocolate cake soon. But now they also introduce the sugar bricks. Yes, you just put nine sugar into a thing like that and you'll I mean like a nine sugar and yeah you get it um, they also added a sweet house which will give you loads of food and random stuff so I got all of these from the these sweet houses and the uh, sweet houses supposedly are quite rare but um, I've managed to find about six in one desert and they're all pretty close less than a hundred blocks away from each other so yeah and they were in a village too now they yeah they've done a lot of stuff they've added glass and um, they've also added algae which um, you won't see in this because you know the world didn't spawn with it so it won't spawn at all anymore unless you probably go very far so yeah now basically um let's just walk down or whatever so as you can see from all that distance you can see the bridge wooden thing that i've built and we already have another mob down here so we'll be killing this um they'll fall regularly so you can just walk in kill them put their junk in this chest Maybe get some rare stuff. Yeah, that was already there before I put that in. Ah, uh, some delicious fish. So, we walk down this wooden pathway. Um, now, the this pathway actually connects it to the next island, or the next continent. Whatever you want to call it. But w it is connected to the forest. Um, there is going to be a wooden house here. Um, for storing wood and all that stuff like right about here and then there will be a path that will keep continuing and eventually make it to the village over there now as you can see over there I've already started construction of it but not much of it but um, over there is going to be a second house for storage and mining is um yeah that's basically it so we will build this for a little bit 
now we're going to go back home and to um show a different thing which I probably should have done that first but oh well walking along walking along some colorful sheep um yeah I'll take their wool I'm gonna take their wool right now so some blue wool some red wool some orange some green some yellow some cyan some purple some white more white and black all right so oh oh i want your wool so okay we got two cows in there to basically get more milk and maybe get more cheese base so what you do with um these new furnace things or, or whatever they're called you can now smelt sugar to get caramel and you can smell zombie meat to get parified meat um, I don't recall but oh yeah if you heat buckets of milk you'll get cheese I'd recommend heating it or cooking it whatever it is with uh, wood you're not gonna waste coal on it so might as well I got a new pickaxe the silk touch one it took my level 30 away for the second time so and over in here is going to be a minecart system yes for transporting yourself and transporting material this one's going to take a bit of time uh, as you can already well tell this took me a little bit to get and um, I'm supposed to actually make it all the way to the mm, all the way to the house over by the well the second house so that's what we're gonna have to do in this episode we're going to build the mining house thing so we'll take five stacks for now it would be much easier if I had the minecart system but like I said that's going to take a little bit to build and unfortunately we just don't have the time for it in this episode walking down the wooden path oh yes we're going to put a house right here for storage because the the first house, the brick house, it's starting to fill up. And I just don't really have much to do with that. So now we are here. Um, but basically the design of this is that we'll put fences here. Going around the whole perimeter of the house. Um, let's see. Ah, uh, yeah, so we're gonna have to build over this, obviously. Put one dirt. Um, I have no idea what the floor is going to be just yet. Um, I'm thinking of cobblestone or wood. But, you know, I don't know what kind of material to use. I'm gonna have to make this place a little brighter. I'm thinking of putting the wood, uh, <laughs> the wood, the w the floor as wood, but it can also be kind of like some kind of stone. I don't know, stone brick, heck, you know, cobblestone. That's gonna give us a lot of dirt. And you know what? I'm gonna forget this house for a little bit. We're gonna need to get glass wart. Cause it is one go that's going to be um, some take some effort into it. So now we're going to uh, expand the road. We're going to build the house 
right about here is storage for wood so what we can do is we can put a block of dirt down there because we need it to be there um, we'll put this like that we're going to need this type of wood and bam 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 now we have oak slabs so put that down um, and then there there we go simple enough but now we actually need more spruce wood so I'll be chopping that down um, we're going to put some of those spruce sa spruce saplings over here so that we can like get wood easier instead of having to go back and forth we just keep all the most of the wood cutting back there so let's grab an our axe um, I'll, I'll show you guys the uh, recipes for the food stuff maybe you know later you know what I'm gonna show it to you guys in the video right now so um, near the end I'll take out a recipe book and then yeah And look at that. One of those stupid pieces of wood are stuck up there. Come on, get down here. Alright, one sp sapling. Two sapling. Okay, okay. I'm getting all this wood. Oh, of course it gets stuck up there again. Give me my wood. Uh, yeah, let's just take these over to the forest. Yeah, look at all these trees. They're planted. Planting trees. Because we're green, you know. I'll be doing a lot of fishing. Have a fishing market. Put some ice in there. If we can find a tundra or ice plains of any kind. I don't think there are any nearby. I haven't found one, but I found a lot of deserts, jungles, and things of that sort. But not a single one of those. Oh, uh, yeah, we're going to also need some oak. Oak tree wood. Oak wood tree. Six. Whole bunch whole bunch of that wood I'm making pine trees in a forest that doesn't have pine trees oh well okay bam that's some deliciousness just put that there get that grass out of there Okay, so now the road will go down about this way. So I'm going to get rid of the junk over here. I don't have a shovel. So I'll have to do this with my torch. Destroy it. Come on, hurry up. You know, if you don't got tools, this is, gonna, this is some tedious stuff right here. Um, we're going to level this out a bit using the dirt we just got we're probably gonna need more dirt in fact so um, I'll end it right there that's where the end of this house will be so the wall is, will be right here um, this house isn't going to be too big that's basically all I know for now obviously because I have to keep patching this up going to have a wooden floor lots of wood stuff in general maybe a cake some food gonna be a chicken coop here that's for sure because we don't have chickens on the mainland main house thing place so we can yeah this is about good ah got gotta keep that torch over there Alright, 
taken out more of this stuff. Uh, we're gonna need a block, right? Whoa! What? I didn't destroy that much. Bam, 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 bam. All right, so let's put the door right over there. Ah, fall damage. Crafting there to the door. The door. Let's make a shovel too. Shovel. Obviously, some of the building will be made out of cobblestone. Hmm. Yeah, I'll just put this as wood for now. Oh yeah. Yeah, having fun with that door there. Okay, so using this shovel, let's destroy this crud right here. Set that down. Now we can build it. We are going to build it in a pattern. Zigzaggy. Zigzag pattern. Um, some wood here. Wood here. Oh, what's that? Zombie. Oh, back off. Back off. Back off. Yeah, this sword is about to break. I don't know how many uses it has left. But it's down there, as you guys can see. Uh, right there, right there, right there, right there. 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 Hm. Just end it right there. Uh, keep going, keep going, keep going. Alright, so... We have the wood done. We're gonna need more wood for this construction of sorts. So we'll be, I'll be right back getting some wood, obviously. So I'll see you guys later. All right, guys. Didn't take too long, but um, got some more wood. So now my ideas were that uh, once I created the road all the way to the village, I will cre build a wall surrounding it and then I will kind of build some kind of castle fort thing right by it so and then there'll be a minecart system going to it um, I don't know how am I how I'm going to do s like a minecart system it's probably gonna have to be in a circle formation so probably it's gonna start at the house for sure going to run all yeah you know what we're gonna have two minecart systems actually, now that I think of it. We're gonna have one that goes above ground, obviously to this area here, so I don't have to walk there at certain times. And then I'll have a underground an underground one that goes to the village. I think that will be actually a pretty cool idea. Don't know how much time it is going to take, but uh it should probably take a little bit though. Probably Ah, there goes the sword. We're gonna get out of here. And we're gonna make another sword. Get some more f melons. Oh, man. Yeah, this is obviously why you need to have a minecart system. So, um, I guess I'll walk from the house all the way to over here. So, this is where going the minecart subway station the minecart station will be right here it will go over there maybe we're gonna need lots of glass some cobblestone 